Today is the day that we feel like we've been waiting for forever. We're finally going to be getting the Channel Tunnel to France to start our journey around Europe. So we made it through um, the pet passport section. Um, really easy. Yeah, it was really easy. We were really worried because um, we've heard like so many horror stories about people's animal health certificates not being right. Um, but yeah, so we were really worried. But thank God, it was all fine. It was okay. Didn't need anything. We got on an earlier train, so we got an hour earlier. Yeah. Uh, so we're boarding in a minute. Yeah, so, so we'll easy. We're just in the dog walking section. Lottie's having a good run around before we get on the tunnel. Um, so yeah, it was super easy. And then we'll see you in France. So we've just made it onto the tunnel. Yeah, so they did ask quite a lot of questions um, at Passport Control. Um, they were quite thorough, but we've managed to make it onto the tunnel. Yeah, so we managed to make it on and we uh, managed to get on a train which was an hour earlier than the one that we planned because we were here nice and early. Um, so yeah, we're just waiting to get to France now, so it should take about 35 minutes. Yeah, so, and then we've got, we've got a campsite well, an air, uh, about an hour, an hour, hour and a half away from Calais. Uh, so a short little stint and then we'll settle up there. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't. to see the world in action what we can be life with no distractions we'll get away this is what we waited for take my hand we'll make it somehow we can't miss out i'm done living life with the lights our first stop was an air that we found on Park for Night, just outside of a small commune called Embry, about an hour away from Calais. It was ten euros to stay overnight, and facilities were available at an extra cost of three euros. Whilst we were here, we met a lovely couple from Holland called Paul and Mary, who invited us to have cakes with them to celebrate Paul's 60th birthday. We couldn't have asked for a better way to start our trip, and we're so happy we met such kind and friendly people. 
I'm not really asking We'll get away To a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Like we know the the next day we travelled almost three hours to Deauville, which is a seaside resort, famous for its grand casino, golf courses, horse races and American Film Festival. wondering what all these famous names are uh, on these beach huts. So we googled it and there's actually an American annual film festival that's held here. So there's just literally hundreds and hundreds of these beach huts all with different film stars on them. Lovely here. This looks like something out of a fairy tale. where we stayed last night it's actually right outside a church um, it was actually a really nice park up it's quite busy now and um, we got here at about six o'clock and it was busy then as well but um, it quietened down quite a lot through the evening so no issues at all and um, we found it on park for night so we'll put the link in the description below about to see the world in action
there's this street down here and it really looks like Diagon Alley from Harry Potter and it's actually one of the most googled things um, is this the street where Harry Potter was filmed it really looks like it so we've come back to um, Mont Saint Michel this morning to see it in sunrise because we loved it so much yesterday and it looks so pretty it's cold very cold it's but... really cold it's really frosty on the ground I'd recommend coming at this time. There's literally no one around. We've literally got the whole place to ourselves. And it's what, half seven? Yeah, it's so quiet. We came yesterday at about 4 p.m. I think it was. Yeah, which is also a good time because the crowds were very, very quiet, less busy. Uh, stayed overnight in the car park. I think it's 12.50. 12 12.90 to 12. stay off season of uh, 24 hours. It's the closest car park you can get to the monument. Yeah, it just looks so nice this morning. I'll show you the sunrise. Thank you so much for watching our first France vlog, we really do appreciate it. If you like this video please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and please do subscribe if you would like to see more of our travels in France. See you next time!